Righto, this is part two um, of the upgrade. Um, you can actually just see this is the interface from Snack Tech. Uh, battery voltage on the right hand side is a little bit, uh, it only goes to scale 16, so you're getting a bit of a force reading until I get the firmware um, uh, updates to reflash the thing. It tells me how many um, PV um, power and stuff like that, PV voltage, PV current. Um, yeah, so just forget about the voltage thing at the moment on the battery. Uh, just starting to do a, um, a scale of things it is. Yeah, so, um, right, uh, I'm just into part two. I've just run a couple of batteries. This is the bottom side of it. It is, um, yeah, it'll actually have two uh, 105 amp hour 12 volt batteries in the system. That's what's uh, out there now to be replaced. I've just, um, Powered all up, I have. Uh, you'll see 48 volts is the output. You can see the Snack Tech um, web access that actually comes out of the bottom side of the EP Solar. Uh, the MT50 is not running at the moment because it's unplugged. You've either got to run one into the other. Uh, that's only if I want to access the cabinet and I want to actually see what the readings are. But it's actually giving me the readings now if I go through and I actually um, page it, I do. Um, yeah, battery voltage 2.7, temperature's 30, uh, my load is half an amp, which isn't too bad, 0.4 of an amp, so it's going in between on 24 volts, so it's about 12 watts is all it's actually running at the moment uh, on, the, on the load side of things on 24. Uh, it says I've done one kilowatt, but I've had it running for a little while. Um, my load, yeah, is actually on the solar is 117. It is. Um, yeah, you can actually see the uh, ubiquity switch. I've set uh, management ports not being used. I've run 24 in the uh, air fiber, the air max, the battery monitor, and the air gateway all run on 24 volts. Um, you can actually see that I've actually got the. Um, the battery monitor and the air gateway, the other plug that actually is plugged into there is actually plugged into my local network at the moment just to uh, to test everything. And that's the um, the uh, Tycon battery monitor uh, with network. Um, what sounds actually will run on uh, PoE 24 or PoE uh, 48 volts, it doesn't really matter. It has its own fuse. Uh, the lights are on. Uh, on the Snack Tech um, uh, web server, uh, which is the red, orange, and green, tells you that it's all all running fine, and um, and that um, so uh, everything seems to be uh, all, all in all. That gives you the idea of the underside for the two couple of um, um, 32 mil bits of conduit coming out with the two Andersons. Um, for the um, for the solar panels and the uh, battery that'll be in another box, so um, yeah, everything looks all right. Um, it's all up and running on uh, UNMS uh, on Ubiquity uh, server that I've got to keep a a, um, a monitoring hand of it. So all good.